Hello, today we are going to uh, perform the localization technique of the cultural bone concept. Uh, today our topic is the lumbar spine. So, before going to treat the lumbar spine, we have some manual localization technique in which segment there is a problem. So, in the lumbar spine, we have a five segment. So, individually we localize uh, how to localize in which segment we have a problem. The first technique is cranial vertebra ventral. We move uh, the vertebra ventrally the cranial. First, I identify through iliac crest the space between the L4 and L5. Then I move towards the L5. My index finger is on L5 spinous process. Through my hypothena, I put pressure to the L4 and see if there is any abnormal movement or there is any symptom of pain. Moving toward L4 and I move the cranial vertebra ventral and to localize which segment is involved. For this technique, we also use the wedge. Now my finger is on L5 and on the transfer process of the L4 I put a wedge. By pressing the wedge I localize the symptom. We can also localize the symptom through quadrant. First, we identify where is L1. My index finger is on T12 from downward L1. Now I push L2. L3. L4. We can also use the wedge to identify or localize the our targeted segment. Now we are going to third test. It is called spinning test. I put my finger on the transfer process of the L5 vertebra and from my other hand the hypothena I put pressure ventrally and give some oscillations. Through this springing test we can localize the target segment. The another localized technique is rotation. So I stabilize the L5 spinous process and rotate the L4 spinous process toward the right side. Stabilize L4 and rotate the trans spinous process of the L3 vertebra. You can check both side rotation. Now I am going to perform the left rotation of the L4 vertebra. The last is transpeteric joint play movement. For the transpeteric joint play movement, for localization, we have to move patient on the side line position. So we move the patient in the side line position. On the side end position, we stabilize the valves, flex 
both legs and patient knees or the bending leg should be at the edge of the table so it can be easily fixed on the anterior side of the my thigh or my groin area from my left hand i localize the spinous process of the lumbar spine this technique is also called uh, this grip is also called the piano grip through this i just push the lumbar spine into flexion extension and localize the segment for mobilization 